Acts 16, 16. Listen to this. And it came to pass, as we went to prayer, a damsel possessed with a spirit of divination met us, which brought our master much gain by what? Susan. This sat 16. This certain damsel was possessed with a spirit of divination. And he was using this spirit to bring gain to his master. By what, sir? By soothsaying. Verse 17. The same followed Paul and us and cried, saying, This man are the servant of the Most High God, which chew unto us the way of salvation. That's why I'm telling you, for somebody to be saying, Hold in the name of Jesus Christ, receive your healing. Don't just say amen like that. The Son, the Spirit behind. Somebody can be using another spirit to use the name of Jesus to work for him. So, this, this person with the spirit of divination know the way of salvation. Say salvation. Eh? He, she calls salvation. But, verse 18. And this did she many days, but Paul, being grieved, turned and said to the spirit, I command thee in the name of Jesus Christ to come out of her. And it came out the same hour. So, you can know, you can see that that's why I was telling you that the fact that the prophet says something that is true about you does not mean is a right spirit. So don't just be looking for a prophet who will be telling you things, things, things. You yourself also be prophetic. Yeah. We together church. So this spirit follow them and follow them and follow and just, ah, just said this this thing. That what you have said is true. We are men of God truly. We have come to show these people the way of salvation, but the motive, the spirit is wrong. She has done that to give the master was a gain by suit was a sin. So what happened here by Paul discerning that spirit is called discerning of was a of spirit. This is not just a discernment. It's the spirit of discerning that is in operation. Did you get what I've just said now? 